In my experience of running the organization, one of the most important things big picture that I learned was not to pretend to know everything. Having that skill of recognizing when you don't know something and that you should be reaching out for help and not only just reaching out, but listening and taking help from others can be incredibly important. Mainly you're going to be looking at your elevator pitch. If you can't define or explain your idea in a sentence or two, then you're not going to be able to drag in a bunch of potential investors who may be interested in your product. One of the key aspects to starting a successful business is to find team members who will devote themselves to the success of the business and who are passionate about your mission. Anyone can give you money, but you really want somebody that is going to believe in your mission, not solely look at the return on investment. A key advice for those looking to start their own venture is to understand the commitment between starting one. Not only will you need to put down a significant financial investment, but you also need to put down some degree of emotional investment too. If you're an introvert, you need to adapt your personality to build connections. Remember that as your business grows, you'll need to dedicate more and more time to it. Having a group, whether it's big or small, who are all working together, dedicated toward that common goal, but most importantly are willing to challenge one another moving forward and to find solutions to difficult questions that may arise can be so important to defining that success. Just go for it. The longer you wait, the longer it will take to become successful. You really don't need to be a business expert to start because there are going to be so many mentors along the way that are willing to help you out. So make sure to follow your dreams guys because you can be equally as successful as we are.